For clinically note positive patients who had achieved lymph node negative after a targeted axillary dissection surgery, and what is your opinion about omitting radiation therapy for these patients? Well, certainly I'll say first, I'm looking forward to talking about the targeted axillary dissection and approach to axillary management as part of our, you know, the upcoming conference in my talk. Um, and I will say that it is definitely compelling for patients who have complete responses to therapy that were previously node positive to consider um, dialing back extent of therapy. And I think we've done that by being able to offer these patients targeted axillary dissections already. Um, that already significantly reduces the risk for lymphedema for a patient, which is wonderful. I think the next question, as you allude to, is, well, do those patients still then receive the same benefit from radiation, or might those patients be able to omit radiation as well? There's obviously some data that suggests that may be a case, the case for a certain subset of patients, um, but we have a national um, cooperative group clinical trial that really looked at just this very question and randomized patients who had been node positive, who received preoperative chemotherapy and had a complete pathologic response in the nodes, and they were randomized to having um, radiation or not. And so that trial um, has accrued fully 